Hey what's going on guys it's Shiva Mir and in this video I'll be giving my review of the JBL Endurance Fun Bluetooth version so let's get into it. So before getting to the video, if you want to watch this video in Hindi, you can do that from the top right corner. So recently JBL came up with their new JBL Endurance series, which was a series specially designed for sports persons. And they had couple of earphones in that series like the JBL Endurance Dive, Jump, Sprint, etc. And each earphones had their own flavor of sound. But the basic earphones in this series was the Endurance Run, which I also reviewed on the channel. And a lot of you guys also loved that earphones. So JBL recently launched a Bluetooth version of the JBL Endurance Run. So basically both of these earphones are identical in everything except this is the wired earphones and this is not, this is the wireless one. But rest remains the same like the quality, the sound quality and all that stuff. I just wanted you to know this guys because if you're running low on budget then you can also go with the JBL Endurance Run, the known Bluetooth version one and save a lot of cash and get same things with these earphones. But anyways that was it for earphones. We will discuss more about like the design, build quality, comfort, battery life, sound quality and price later in this video. But before that let's just unbox this and see all the contents of it and then we will proceed further. So here's the packet from Amazon and as always this is not very prettiest looking box. So let's just quickly unbox this and see all the contents of it. So here's the retail box of the JBL Endurance Run Bluetooth. Here you can see the image of the earphones itself. These comes in three different colors like the JBL Endurance Wide one. This is the black color and this do comes in red and green as well. So you can check out all the colors from the links down below in the description. But other than that we have the JBL logo on the top and here it says Endurance Run BT. Now here are some features wireless and sweat proof. Now here it also says Bluetooth and as we move further we can also see some contents of the box. There is one earphones, three sizes of ear tips, ear hooks and warranty card. Now here it also says the frequency response of these earphones which is 20 hertz to 20 kilohertz and it says 8 millimeter a driver. Now on the other side it also says the tagline which is dare to listen and as we move further we have some specs of these earphones that is hands free calls and just like the wired endurance run this also have magnetic buds and this also has flip hook technology. So this means it will stay in your ears whether you are running or doing any type of workout. So this is the JBL technology which helps the earphones to stay in your ears. On the top we can also see the battery life of these earphones which is 6 hours. We'll test that out in a minute. But it also says 15 minutes of charge will give you 1 hour of playtime which is amazing. Now on the back we can also see the MRP of the device which is 3200 rupees and this cost a little less than that. We will do a price reveal later in this video. So that was the reading of the outer box and now if you open it up we can see some more features of these earphones like the twist lock technology, the flex soft comfort, lightweight design and secure fit. Now as you can see the earphones are here sitting nicely in the package and one more thing to notice here is that some more features about these earphones. Here you can see that you can use the flip hook technology like you can put them like a regular earphones or when you're using it for running then you can also just put it behind your ears and this way these won't fall out easily. Now it also shows it has a button to answer calls or change tracks or play both songs or using Google Assistant or Siri. So that was all the specs of these earphones and now let's just take them out. So here are the earphones sitting nicely in the package. So let's just take them out. So here are the earphones and as you can see they are pretty similar to the JBL Endurance Run wired version. The only difference here is that these are the wireless version and these are the wired version and you have to pay a little bit of extra price to get the wireless version. But other than that the earphones are feeling very solid. We have these magnetic buds which is awesome to use as a sports earphones and have these two compartments. One is I guess for the battery and other has the inline mic and all the buttons to change the songs using Google Assistant or Siri. And the great thing is that this also has a volume rocker so you can adjust the volume without taking phone out of your pocket. But we have the whole video to admire these earphones so let's just put this aside and see what else do we have here. 
So we also get this tiny micro USB cable to charge these earphones, which is great. Other than that, we also get two extra pair of ear tips for precise fit and a very thick user manual and quick start guide to get you started. But we are pro at this, so we don't need this, I guess. But that's pretty much it for the unboxing of this JBL Endurance Run Bluetooth. And now let's move to the review of these earphones. And now let's start this review by talking about the design first. So design wise, JBL has designed these earphones for especially for sports person. So that's why this has so much of sporty look to it. The earphones feels very rugged and have this matte finish on all the parts. So it makes them a very premium feeling pair. Now these does come in all the sports color, including red, green, and black. And you can check them out from the links down below in the description. But other than sporty colors, the earphones are also very lightweight earphones. I mean, this is not very lightweight that it will make you feel like you're wearing nothing in your ear. But this does have enough weight, a certain weight to it, which makes you feel like you're using very premium, high quality earphones. Now along with this decent weight, the earphones also have decent comfort levels as the earphones are meant for sports activity. So the JBL might decide to make the earphones a little bigger so that it fits tightly in your ears. But this sometimes produces some pain in your ears like after 2-3 hours of listening and maybe if you have smaller ears then you might face this problem early on. But there is a workaround to it. You can decrease the inner size of the earbuds by removing this silicone tip and then installing the silicone ear tip back again. This way you can make these earphones like regular earphones and have a little more comfort. Now there are a couple of some cool features to these earphones like the flip hook technology and twist lock technology that I just wanted to explain it to you. So flip hook technology is a technology, a design feature I would say, which enable you to use these earphones in two different ways. One is that you can use these earphones just like regular earphones. But when you're doing some fitness activities and you want some extra grip, then you can just wear these earphones from behind the ears and it won't go away even in the intense workout sessions. The second one is the twist lock technology. So essentially you can just wear these earphones and then just twist it further and this will result in a better fitting as this will go deeper inside your ear canal. So both of these features make them very perfect for a sports earphones at least for the design and fitness. But other than those two features, we also have a couple of more features. Like these earphones have magnetic earbuds, which makes them very easy to wear and manage when you're not using these earphones. And I think it's a must feature for any sports earphones. And another must feature that this earphone has is the IPX5 water and splash rating, which makes you less worry about water or splashes seeping inside the earbuds and damaging the earphones. So those were all the good features about these earphones, but as nothing in this world is perfect, so do these earphones are. So the first downside is this big bulky compartments. There are two big compartments suspended on the cable, which are very bulky and heavy. So if you don't adjust the cable length from the speed, then these will keep on dangling around your neck. And I think this is the most cases with all the wireless earphones. Second one is the micro USB port. I know it's not a huge deal, but at this price point, we can expect a USB Type-C port since I have all these USB Type-C devices laying around. And these also doesn't come with a carrying case. At this price point we can expect a carrying case at least. So it would be much more convenient to use. But now you just have to throw them in your pocket or in your backpack. But other than those points, we still have some more things to talk about. And then we will go through the battery life and the sound quality. So the earphones have buttons on the one side of the compartment, which includes a button to answer calls and for Google Assistant or Siri. And we also have volume rocker to adjust the volume and changing track. Now this also has an inline mic to answer calls. And this is the sound quality of that. Now coming down to the battery life of these earphones, these has a battery of 120 milliamp hour. It has something called speed charge or you can say fast charging. So it took less than an hour to charge full and after full charge I got a playtime of five and a half hours at 80% of volume. So it's a decent battery life for an earphones like this considering the charging time that it takes. But now here comes the crucial part of any audio device which is the sound quality itself. So for this sound quality of the JBL Endurance Run Bluetooth, I would say they are a great pair of earphones. First of all, it covers all the hearing range of humans, that is 20 Hz to 20 kHz. And in real life, it does produce good frequency response. I mean, I could hear all the bass, mids and highs clearly. But something I want to address here is that these earphones lacking a little bit in sub frequencies. 
I mean it's enough to get you going but if you want to get that 808 to hit on your face then nah, not happening bro. For genres, the earphones are perfect for almost all types of genres but they shine best on energetic songs. I don't know why this has some certain flavor to it that when you're listening to some tribal traps or some energetic EDM they just stand out of the other earphones. So overall I would say they are great sounding earphones for workout and as well as casual listening. But this also brings us down to the cost of these earphones so now let's talk about that. So for the price you can get these earphones for 40 to 50 dollars or 3000 rupees but as always JBL has some lightning deals going on so you can get this around for 2649 rupees or around 40 dollars and you can try your luck from the links down below in the description. But for the price I would say they are a little bit just a touch expensive. If this would have been for 2000 rupees then these would be the best pair of earphones for sports and workout but also for 2650 rupees I would say considering all the features and sound quality these are still the best pair of sports earphones that you can get under this price range. And also if you still are a little tight on budget then you can also consider the wired one as these are pretty identical to the wireless one except there is just a long wire attached to it. Rest the sound quality and design is the same so you can save some cash that way. But that was today's video hope you guys enjoyed this and if you did just click the like button below, share this video with your friends and subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet and I'll catch you guys in the next one.